A sheepdog trial and hound show is on today, and it's just down the valley. Farm culture is still alive and well in these fertile hills. From gritty shepherds to gentlemen farmers to curious tourists, there's something for everyone. While lots of fun and plenty entertaining, competitions like these have practical roots. They go back to a time when agility and hunting instincts made a hound truly man's best friend. According to the program, a good fell foxhound must have good shoulders, long neck, level back, and agile hind legs to jump those stone walls. The scene itself offers a fascinating glimpse into this culture. From shepherd's crooks, to tailgate party dog talk. And the main event, as explained to us by a local aficionado, is the shepherd and his dog bringing in the sheep as quickly as possible. The shepherd goes out, he's given a given position where he stands at the post and he has to direct his dog out on the right or the left to the material. Dogs, you can work them um, half a mile away. They'll pick the sound up and they will hear you. And they can work them half a mile away, collecting sheep, putting them together, bring them into a flock, bring them as near in a straight line as possible down the course, through the hurdles there, back to the pen, hopefully nice pen, straight in, no breaks, and the applause. Working aboard a collie, it's like marriage. It's got to click. You must have confidence in one another. The dog will have confidence in you if you've got confidence in him. It's as beautiful as that, and it's lovely to work with them. 